Well, Hellfire, it is Rock the Riff, and we're back into another Metalhead Envy. Now, this track comes from another suggestion in my comments uh, by 94DJ and Neck. I'm hoping I'm saying your name right. Uh, please listen to this stuff. Call of Sirens featuring Dominic Kristoff. Lazarus, Lazarus, Super Guy. New kicking ass song. So, Lazar, Laser, Laser, Sazer. How the hell do you even say this? <laughs> Laser, Laser Saurus, Super Guy. Laser Saurus, Super Guy. Is that how how we we say it? And yeah, so never heard this group before. And uh, the last suggestion, which was a Static Perfection, Gods and Gold or Golden Gods, Gods and Gold, I think that was a pretty kick-ass song. So I'm hoping this fan or fans, I'm hoping this suggestion is another kick-ass track. And uh, yeah, let's dive on in. Was bisher geschah. Der tückische Lord Schorlinator stahl alle Schorlevorräte vom Planet Palatinum, um seinen nie endenden Durst zu bändigen. So I've already got to say, I dig the uh, retro filter and uh, have no clue what the fuck they're saying. Sofort eilten die fünf Todespfälzer zu Hilfe und konnten ihn mit vereinten Kräften bezwingen. Jetzt befinden sie sich vor seinem Hauptquartier und feiern ihren Sieg mit, wie könnte es anders sein? So, one more question and one more compliment to the video because this is already, I'm already digging the fuck out of the video. Is that Chipe Core? Type Core? C, C Ipe Core? So, is this kind of like uh, the algorithm? Is this more of a metal electronic thing? I think that's the name of the guy or the band I'm thinking about. The algorithm, maybe? I don't know. I'm kind of going dumb for a second. Vollen Schorle. So, dem haben wir's gezeigt. Jetzt werden die Fässer vom Schorlinador gekillt. Cheers. Ich muss eine gute Schorle in der Hals. Das schmeckt ja, als wäre das Mischungsverhältnis falsch. Das ist doch nicht halb-halb. Das bedeutet eine Verschiebung im innerchronologischen Zeitfenster. Apparently that's a bad thing. Hang on, y'all got some production, man. That I that went from retro filter to like super crisp. Stein, Stein, Stein. Oh man. Mama, Papa, guck mal da oben. Was ist das? Das kenne ich nicht. Das schauen wir uns mal an. So sorry to keep pausing, but I'm already getting. This whole their sense of humor is very twelve foot ninja -ish style too. Hallo, welche Zeit, hey man? Na Steinzeit. Oh shit! That was a killer drop in. And this dude's vocals. Oh, God. I love to hear people that can scream really well. I mean, there's so many vocalists doing the whole whatever you call it, growl, screaming, scream oh, whatever you want to call them. But that dude's highs and then his lows are really good. I mean, I'm assuming if you can go that good high and that good low, your mids are going to be really killer too. But damn, man. Like, I did not expect this. I, Because I'm sitting here looking at the Sipe core, and then I don't understand what that is. I have, I am terrible with genres. I was just, it's metal, or it's not metal. Uh, this is fucking metal. This is metal as fuck.
So they're saying laser Sorius. Okay. Shout out to the LTD Viper. I've got one on the wall myself. And I want to know where the hell you moved your top buckle piece to. Looks like you put it on that top horn. Because, uh, well, is that an LTD Viper? Maybe I'm being stupid. That's the one drawback to the Viper's design that I don't understand is that top buckle for the strap. They put it in the middle of the neck, and I mean, it just it just don't work. I mean, they're top heavy. Their headstock is just so fucking heavy. You basically have to hold it up, even when you have it on your shoulders. It's a nice little tremolo. <laughs> Yeah, a little speaker change. Oh, that's cool. Oh, shit. Fighting the T-Rex. Fucking Thor shot him with the lightning bolt. Oh, shit. Oh, it's a shrink ray. Wir sind zurück. Ich kann das sagen. Es war nicht einfach mit den Lasersauriern. Aber wir haben sie geschrumpft. Aufpassen. Die sind so klein, dass sie nicht siehst. Da sind sie drin. Stell das sie gerade an, gell? Dankeschön, ihr Todespilzer. Und jetzt ihr Buben nehmen ein Robert Scholle und dann abheben mit eurer Zeit und der Wirra. Oh, da ungerebt, Knotze. Ich probier mal. Ich hoffe, es schalle mich, weil das stimmt diesmal, du harte Bombe. Oh, nein! <lacht> okay. That was cool. Thank you for the comment. Uh, let me pull your name up again. 94 DJ, DJ Anek. Hope that's how you say your name. And uh, that was fucking cool. That was a really cool track. I like the video a lot. I would say that the main vocalist, uh, the guy with the eye patch, I just think he is fucking murdering. Damn, he's got such a good tone. I love his highs. His highs especially is probably what I like the most. His lows are really good. The other vocalist, uh, he's good too. Um, he sounds more like he's yelling than actually breaking that little bit of that phlegm or whatever you call it to get that scream like that or whatever you, I don't know. I can't do it myself. That's, um, uh, 
the only nitpick I can I can say in that, which is not really a nitpick. It was cool. The track is very catchy. And yeah, I definitely think I will dive more into Call of Sirens. I kind of, like, I assume YouTube does subtitles sometimes, so maybe if I could go back and watch again with subtitles and understand what the fuck they were saying, I would get more of the jokes, maybe. But as a dude that only speaks English, that was very fun. I enjoyed the hell out of that. And, uh, yeah. Go check out Call of Sirens. If you uh, like my content, leave a like, subscribe, and plenty more to come. But until the next one, stay positive, stay rocking. I'm out.